Welcome to the world's second shortest podcast, Wellbeing Wisdom Tiny Bites, where you get actionable, evidence-based, waggalicious answers to real-world problems in 90 seconds or less. I'm Sandy Weaver. Here's today's Tiny Bite. You know that phrase, take the high road? Going back to the 1600s, the phrase has been used to indicate choosing a moral way to react or behave, and the earliest references were about a high road leading to heaven and the low road leading to, well, you know. Now, think about that person in your life who seems to never pick the high road. They live to stir the pudding, they pit one person against another and sit back and enjoy the fireworks, they take credit for the accomplishments of others. You know somebody like that, right? In your mind, they have no high road. Can you give them one? Can you try to see their actions from your high road? Instead of focusing on their misdeeds, can you try to understand why they behave badly? Many people had less than optimal upbringings. Maybe their behavior is a result of abusive parents, absent parents, or very ineffective parents. When you can take the high road when dealing with someone who seems bound and determined to take the low road, you may be pleasantly surprised when they start living up to your expectations. Want more? Come and play in the Wagalicious Life online community playground. Go to wagalicious.life. That's W-A-G-A-L-I-C-I-O-U-S dot life. Here's to your success, one tiny bite at a time.